Okay, we have under over here. Defensive drill, pursuit, hustle, heart, toughness, all that kind of stuff. Um, but this is the first time we ran it. And right here, I think the, these two, Hannah on the left, Mo on the right, you know, some of the contacts weren't great. They were just touches. They were just, you know, trying to get through the drill, not understanding that, you know, the more time you create, the better digs we can, can have the more it counts. You know, Mo does a great job here. The, the second time we've gone through it in the fall, um, you know, she takes care of the ball, gets that ball high. Cece gets that ball high back to the court. Mo does a good job of hustling. Here's Kylie digging right in front of you and Emily Londot going the dig right there. Um, you know, they, they did a good job of this. They're hustling through, they're onto the next ball and they're making efforts to get that ball high. You know, sometimes they don't get it, but they need both of these touches for it to count. So they need the run through and then the pursuit ball they get both of those high to the middle of the court. You know, how you set your standards for this, who's counting is a big deal. If you just allow people to go through it, they'll just make low contacts, low digs. And, and when you're holding the standard high and, and having a team that holds that standard high, it's better because then that, that those contacts matter every time we're, we're touching the ball. Those people out of the drill also have to control some of the chaos here and, and get the balls out of the way. Sometimes we're, we're better at it than others, but you know, that's part of it too. How do we communicate throughout this drill?